What's up, low gangsters? Welcome back to Worst Life Hacks number three. I'm your host, Mr. Period Beast, not to be confused with Mr. Beast, my brother, two completely different people. This is the second life hack that this man has hurt matches for no good reason. I feel like one by one is not the fastest way to do it. Is that, that really what he's doing? One by what? Okay, there you go. I love how he pet them. Like, good boys. Who's a good boy? They are. Matches need love and affection too. I love how he's just doing it super slow. It's for that aesthetic pleasing, you know? Like, life hack channels are catering to like children because mm -hmm. they have like good visuals. So he's like, I, I'm not thinking any of that's true, but okay. Oh, dude, is he about to light this on fire? Yeah. I swear to God, if he blue balls. It doesn't work that well. You know why? Why? Because there's no air in the bottle. There's like the smoke is getting trapped in the bottle and that's putting out the fire. This is pretty cool. Dude, that camera looks sexy. Yeah, and, look uh, at the flames. Whatever camera they're using. Why don't we <laughs> Why don't we have that on our main channel? Spends $100,000 every video. Can't afford good camera. Because we spend $100,000 every, every video. video. <laughs> yeah. Is your breath really bad, Mr. Beast? Mr. Period Beast? Uh, Mr. Period Beast has bad breath, but I know Mr. Beast has the best breath the internet's ever seen. This life hack will help people want to talk to you. Just grab a tube of your favorite toothpaste, generously apply it to the mints. Trust me, your breath is horrible. But if you do this, it won't be. And so it's like a double whammy. Yeah, it's like super mega ultra fusion. The next life hack is a free way to get money. Waiting in line and want a Snickers bar but can't afford it? Yank out your tooth, hold it out, count to three, boom, money. Here's the life hack, guys. Go to the store. Right, have have a uh, kind of images pop up as I'm saying this. Go to a glass store, buy a pair of glasses, go to Walmart, buy spray paint, boom. So far $25. Spray on it, boom. Now your glasses are worth $200. Resell it, that's how you become a billionaire. No, I mean, that's pretty genius. I'm, I mean, is that even a life hack? That's what literally companies do. Like, how else are sunglasses made? A lot of people enjoy pineapple on their pizza, but if you want to prove your friends that you are a real psychopath, you know, like a maverick, just take a handful of watermelon and smear it all over your pizza. You know what? Just dump the entire bowl on it, because who doesn't like soggy pizza? Pineapple wasn't crazy enough. Imagine if George Washington knew this is what was going to happen. George Washington would have just went back to Europe and been like, alright, pack up your bags. Do you ever try to magically make your coat defy gravity? I mean, look, gravity's making it fall to the floor. The trick to get it to stay up is easier than you think. Just grab a nail and nail your coat to the wall. I guarantee it's not coming off now. I don't know why everyone does that in the movies. Like, hey, let's get some sparks. Let's be dangerous. Connor, everybody does that to make sure that there's power coming from the battery that you're plugged into and that your connection is good. Sorry, I had to correct you on that. <laughs> what is he waiting for? He's charging up his Hot Wheel, man. Oh. Watch, it's about to take out. That's a nice Hot Wheel, actually. Whoa, look, it just <laughs> flew off the table for some reason. What is with this dude in hamachis? I watch anime, not play with hamachis. What are hamachis? That says Hatchimals. Hatch. What are, what are hamachis? Hatchimals? Yeah. What so, is this? So, a lot of people thought these were toys when they were growing up, but they're not. They're actually food. And so people were just playing with them because they were so cute. But what you're actually supposed to do is crack them open and just fry them in a pan. Gotcha. Honestly, I was believing you until I saw them open it. <laughs> and uh, you should be good. You sound like you've eaten a lot of Hatchimals. I have. They're actually very good for you. I, I feel like they're high in vitamin B. Uh, they're, they're high in vitamin D. Gotcha. Okay. I'm so, a little deficient in that. I'll, I'll make sure to up my intake yeah. of Hatchimals. Okay. If you need some more D, just eat a bunch of Hatchimals. Okay. Hatchimals give you the D. Got it. Have you ever wondered where pickles come from? Well, me neither, but this guy is going to show you how to make pickles. Just take a couple of cucumbers, shove them into a jar, and pour Coca-Cola all over them. Now those gross, healthy cucumbers will be soda pickles in around three months. See, that's why I would never do a life hack channel. Just like right when I go to take a bite, I'm, I'd be like, nah, it's not worth it, and just delete the channel. So like, all right, I'm done. Kids, this is how acne is made. Ah, <laughs> what? <laughs> why? Why is it bad? All right. Oh boy. After this, we should set a precedent. No butter. Like, jeez. Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? 
This man just took a whole stick of butter and proceeded to lather a watermelon. I'm sure he's contemplating the, you know, purpose of his life right now. Are your veggies boring and bland? Well, this next hack will teach you how to flavor them up. All right, so he's unwrapping some butter. Gotcha. What? Okay. Oh, is he like getting butter on the knife so when he chops it, they have butter on him? Yeah. I mean, that's not actually that bad. Dr. Phil once said, vegetables aren't healthy unless they have butter. I'm sure you guys are aware, the government is always spying on you. And you're probably wondering like, how can I stop the government from seeing what I'm searching on the internet, you know? So this is how you stop the government from spying on you. There you go. If you don't have internet, the government can't spy on you. Wow, that receipt, very convincing. Are those free range eggs? Cause they have those little freckles on them. Does that mean they're treated nicely? That means they're treated nicely. Good. And I'm glad to see the eggs are being treated nicely in this day. But they were treated nicely until he started putting them in the package. No, I think he's gonna be nice to them. My mom would never buy me Hatchables because she didn't want me to be a loser. So I can't relate. Drawing is hard, but you know what isn't? Driving. So to make sure you always get perfectly straight lines, just take a pencil and glue it to your Hot Wheels. And now you'll have a perfect straight line. The teacher's like, Johnny, do you have a ruler? He's like, no, I got a Hot Wheel. She's like, A-N. And then he glues it, she's like, whoa. A plus. Whoa, you're going straight to college. <laughs> Wait, are you serious? That actually works. <laughs> what? <laughs> If your watermelon ever gets fussy, this life hack will show you how to give it some tender love and the care it needs. Watermelons and babies are pretty much the same thing, so you gotta treat them equal. I mean, literally, you can't tell the difference. They're both stupid. Make sure you keep them nice and warm by wrapping them in a blanket until it calms down and then eat it. Just kidding, you're American, it's too healthy for you. Is that just all this show is? Is that just making fun of Americans? Trying to set up a house of cards is hard and I just don't have the patience. So like all things in life, the best option is to cheat. Just glue the cards together to make the most stable house of cards ever. Like, this thing could be hit with a rocket. More stable than my marriage. <laughs> <laughs> this next life hack is for when you have all your money on the line and you don't have what you need to win. So, you just need some more chips. Just whip out a couple of potato chips. Those actually are just either. And no one will notice the difference. Yeah. But what if you're playing in the basement, you know, and you know, your kid's over there drawing, and you're like, hey. Give me that marker, Johnny. Color on those bad boys, and boom. You might actually win, or you might not, because your luck sucks. If you take the bounciness of a tennis ball and combine it with the rubber ball inside of a tennis ball, you get the bounciest object in the universe. Do you want to read the script, then? Okay, I just read it. You read it super fast, and, and Connor is going to be like... No, well, mm -hmm. sorry, Connor. But I will say this. Just one slam on the table, and boom, you're in space. Elon Musk, he tweeted that. Oh wow. You can buy wow, it bounces. went to the moon. So he's Elon Musk. They found out a way to get into your laptop now. You cut the internet cord and they're still coming in. So you know <laughs> what you do? You take a cracked egg. But okay. see, the government found out new technology to see through tape. Gotcha. So now I, but eggs are see through tape proof. Yes, exactly. Okay. Hey, you can tell he doesn't want to do look, this. Yeah, look at him. He's like, ah, uh, that's good enough. I don't want to actually ruin my laptop. <laughs> he's not committed to the content. <laughs> <laughs> wow, this guy's three arms. Can we get a replay of that? And can I get a picture of what this dude looks like? How? How? What? You gotta massage the tennis ball. Oh! 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 It looked like when it opened his mouth, it was like, oh! <laughs> yes. I, oh, oh. Oh, okay. So he's breaking off the ends of the matches and I just throwing the flammable things in it. Okay. Always make sure your grip is very strong. Alright, so you finish off with one big old boy match, right? So is he lighting this? I'm genuinely, like, interested. What's gonna happen? That's it? The tennis ball doesn't catch on fire? Nope. And then... And he just... Oh, he kicks it? Oh, okay. The kick is the finale I wanted. <laughs> I'm glad he kicked it instead of lighting it on fire. Ah, it's back. The watermelon doing? never leaves! <laughs> Why? What? The watermelon moisturizes! <laughs> what? Why? Why is he doing this? This looks like a very large belly that is being smeared with. Oh, maybe he's trying to show the kids of the world like how to moisturize their stomachs. Yeah. He probably has a basement full of watermelons. <laughs> buttery just, and lotion. Just up. chained to a wall. <laughs> it puts the lotion on its skin. You remember Beyblades? Yep. This is very similar to Beyblades. I hope it's knives on it. Close. So 
in the near future, all battles are not going to be decided on the battlefield. They are going to be decided with razor blade hot wheels. So gotcha, like, gotcha. If we're fighting Russia... We're just going to send in our razor blade the, hot wheels. No, it makes sense because like, why sacrifice humans when you can sacrifice something more valuable? Yeah. Hot wheels. Yeah. If I was a child, I would replicate this. And I, then... I would lose a finger. Yep, same. But it's worth it. You're training to defend your country. Don't do this and sue us, please. Why was that plop so satisfying? Play it again. Wait a minute. <laughs> you know, this actually probably would work. I, I'm pretty sure someone needs to arrest this guy because he's a threat to society. Imagine walking into someone's house and it's just a candle with fruit in it. So there are flies all over your candle. That means it smells good. They didn't know that grilled watermelon was a thing. And uh, I was like, yeah, grilled watermelon is a thing. And then... So we're just gonna let his commentary play? Yeah. It's actually just kind of working. Is grilled watermelon a thing? I don't do research. If this is already a thing, it's kind of a waste of time. A is for Alfred. B is for Pat. You were telling me the other night to spit in my mouth. <laughs> what? All right, we're just going to use their commentary. All right, and that is grilled watermelon. There you go, guys. That's it for the video. We're about to play rock, paper, scissors. Remember, whenever you click on a Mr. Period Beast video, always watch to the end. Because at the end of every video, we play rock, paper, scissors. People that don't play rock, paper, scissors, their parents don't love them. So, get your get your thing in your hand. I choose scissors. Okay, all right, you may have got me the first time. All right, fine, whatever. All right, for this next one, I choose rock. Yeah, take that, it's time now. I choose paper. Oh yeah, I won. Subscribe. High oh. five, Chris. All right, high five symbolizes the end of a video. Bye.